girl. That last match was crazy, man. Look, I've been with a lot of girls. I didn't see a girl like that bad ever. And I'm just saying, probably ain't bad, but you know, you get a girl like that. I'm just saying, I don't know. He must have Ultra Viagra or something. Like stands mixed with Viagra and morphine or something. He anyway, borrowed it from time me. to move it along. We started off the night. You saw the three Burger Kings. <laughs> You're gonna see one of them tonight, but first I'm gonna bring out the go with the most freaking flat Ole, Ole! Alright, here we go! I hate him. If anybody, and I mean anybody, can get this crowd off their feet is of course the go with the most freaking flat! Why does he do this? I got beat up by the three kings. Who wants the pom pom? I think while you're giving out pom poms, kids, I'm gonna bring out your opponent. One of the three kings. Burger Kings. Burger Gino Davies. Ah, uh, the emo boy himself. You know, I know since Gino's been in the WAW, he's done a great deal. And I don't argue any of his accomplishments, but I can also not help but think, man's had a chip on his shoulder since coming back. He talks about respect, doesn't give a single bit. You know, you say it's been since he's coming back. Gino's always had a chip on his shoulder. Yeah. Probably has something to do with his height, you know. Because he needs it. Listen, you keep talking trash against Gino. He's got to come over here and smack that hand over your head. And you know what he's going to get? He's going to get a chair over his head, you know? Help him. They got to pay. Don't worry, you'll cry, baby. Jeez. Unfortunately, if you come and pay for a WAW event, you have full range to do class photography of anyone. You would know, Chaz. Yeah, I would. I mean, that's Actually, my job would. to that's know. That's kind of your stick, isn't it? You know, sit back here and... Knowing the rules? Are you going to be able to see? I'm going to beat him with a tie on. Yeah. Why are you going to beat him with a tie on? Yeah. Why are you going to beat him going to beat him to a tie? <laughs> I'm here till Thursday, folks. Well, I think eventually this match is going to start. I'm going to give it till Tuesday. I stole half your liquor. Wait a minute. What? <laughs> it's in that little pink what? bag over That's there. God damn it. Give me my liquor back. Don't touch. Ah, ah. Oh. Jerk. I hope you enjoy that. I farted when you were down there. It smells like burritos and chili. Ugh. Well, we got right here the... Uh, Speaking of shit smells, we got Gino Diomedes. And freaking Flax trying, I think, to try to get this match going. There's the bell. And Gino now. Lock up. And the goat, obviously, not happy about what happened at Hellbound. Not happy about. Ooh, well. Oh, I'm sorry. Are we keeping you up, Princess. No, just when you talk, I get really tired. And plus, the bore machine was just out here. I'm going to tell him you said that. He'll give you another epic ass kicking. Yeah, sure. Ha, ha, ha. But the fact is right here, Gino Diomedes is taking it to the freaking flex to go with the most, the longest reigning WAW champion. Come on! I actually just noticed that Gino's trying to wrestle this match with his sunglasses on. Well, we don't want to know what substances he may have been on. Yeah, a little Why do you wear sunglasses inside? I never understood that. A oh, dealer can do it. He's the first WAW champion. You got a problem with wearing sunglasses, Chad? Those glasses are getting so yeah. uneven by the end of the night. Clap them up. That's great. All right, now, we'll say this. Whoa, hello. Oh, Gino in the ropes. Now, I'm going to say this. As far as size, skill, speed, these two men are very evenly matched. Gino Not in the bedroom. We're just going to get that right off the bat. You Gino is five that. superior. You, you, went, you went there, didn't you? Someone had to. Uh, why'd you come back then? But I was going to say, Gino Diomedes is very tricky, very quick, knows how to get in your head. Freaking Flax again for all of his uh, <laughs> eccentricities. DTH in the middle of right the ring. Right there. DTH bringing Showing Gino Diomedes down. He can. Right on the glasses. They might have broke those $4,000 glasses right there. Those are Louis Vuitton glasses. 
and Dealer just jacked him. I just want to point that out. Oh, hey, no, oh Frankenstein are sending Gino. Hey, you better not rip that tie. That's a what? George Brooks Armani Brothers? tie. Hey, that's not a Brooks Brothers tie. That's George Armani. I wouldn't know a Brooks Brothers right Gino Armani. Give me those glasses. Don't. Give, me, give me the glasses, Chad. Those are nice. I'm, I'm actually going to. And hold on. Gino going up. Nobody home. <laughs> and Flash doing the roll up. One, One two. two. Schoolboy almost getting a three count. And wait a minute, one, two. Dangerous Coast, like I said, Flax, for all of his eccentricities, and yes, that's a big word, Chad. For all his eccentricities, very quick, very dangerous, knows how to wait for that opportunity, that one moment where you're not paying attention. And he sticks and, his oh, thumb in your bum. Down. That's disgusting. Actually, last week it was, I believe, a Donatello in the bum to... to Dude, Turtle Hag is supposed to poke out, not poke in. I don't know why I have to say that. That is not wrong. Time. That is just not right. <laughs> not right. No one wants a turtle going up their rectum. <laughs> it happened to Dealer once. It's a very traumatic experience, but he doesn't want to talk about it no more. And speaking of traumatic... The turtle with Shaniqua, she... Whoa, wait a minute. Oh, God! Gino! Oh, right there! Three-fourth neck breaker. Got the air on that one. One, two. Nope, that three-hit combo that. proves why he is better than freaking Flax. Yeah, that's why Flax kicked out. You know, he made an impact. Big deal. He didn't pin him. That's going to be right around the corner. It only takes a shallow grave or a headstone. Trust me on that. And off the ropes coming in. Ooh. Big knee. Well, wait a minute. Hold on. Flax, get the advantage in. Trying to go for that figure. Flax right there goes down. Wait a minute. Tries to go for the headstone. And getting his head stoned as we go. Nope. Off the ropes. Gino oh. gets caught. Roll through. Monkey flip. Gino's diving. He's not a vegetarian. That's the second. Oh, wait. Oh, come what? on. Again? Again? you got to be kidding me. This is ridiculous. I mean, I'm all for gain warfare, but you know. And freaking Flex. I mean, he wins the match, but... I'm all for game warfare, but I actually would like to call a full match tonight. Well, I don't think we're going to do it with these three whack jobs in the room. They're right here, man. The winner of this match by disqualification, freaking Flex. What? Yeah, there we go. You know, maybe if they would realize that they'd stop interfering with the match... Gino Diabetes just one. beat freaking Flex. Get out of here! Three queens! Three heads, not a brain cell between them. Maybe one match tonight. Just one full match. Well, tell them to stop interfering. What? What? I'm going up there. What? Where are you going? No. Where are you going? Now, oh. you know what? It's like Christmas in November. It's oh. like the fifth of the month because all of you get to eat for once. Oh, yeah. You get to actually see me do what I do best. But I'm actually not here to talk about myself. Amazing Matt. Matt Bishop, if you actually got laid once in a while, you might not be so goddamn sour. But the fact is, I want someone downstairs to open his ears, I want him to take his little Goya soda and put it on his coaster, he calls a championship, and take his Samoan, Whoa, Puerto wait Rican, a minute. foreign, whatever, ass, and come up to this ring. Well, I can only assume he is referring to the pure champion, Mr. Andreas Reyes. Don't spill your Goya, I know how you are, uh, little Mexicans love that drink. Your malt beverages. You're not gonna pop a cap in my ass, right? I know how you minorities do that. You ain't touching this. You're gonna steal and try to pawn it and put it in your grill. I know how you minorities work.
Oh, you think you know how all oh, my not? Yeah, yeah, right, right. Hey, I got a question. Did you make enough money to buy your 28 cousins uh, selling oranges in front of Home Depot? You're making oh enough. Oh my God. Taco Bell. I know you guys like tacos. Maybe some empanadas. You love empanadas. Seriously, do you have an off switch? Can you mute his mic? I'm working on it. I'm working on well, it. Work harder, because this guy needs to shut up. I'm getting my. I'm getting a headache hearing this guy talk. Constantly, constantly. Rammer, 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 rammer. Nobody cares, all right? Nobody cares. Okay, stop talking. So what's the point of bringing me out here, calling me Samoan, calling me foreign, insulting me? That is totally unnecessary. What did I do to you? Well, for one, look at the color of your skin. That's what you did to me. Two, your oh. guy taking jobs out of people, working Americans like my family. You come to this country and take the jobs at half price. But that's another story for another time. You spick. Oh, oh. Come on. What was this? Oh, oh, before you ask it, I know the question's coming up. I like my peanut butter smooth, because I know you're going to ask that. Yo, we're talking about peanut butter. Talking about, peanut butter. talking about, about peanut, peanut butter. I got a whole boy Sagittarius like to take a nice jar of peanut butter, lube it up all over his thing, and stick it straight up your ass. And you Whoa. talking about peanut butter. Me and Smooth, we go way back. But like I said, I'm not here to talk about me. We're going to talk about the man that you defeated for the very last time at Hellbound. You defeated Jonathan Arkham. But I'm not here to introduce Jonathan Arkham. Thank God. I'm here to introduce the new number one contender for this pure championship. The man who deserves to take that belt off you. Ah. My new protege. What? Derek Conway. Derek? You know about this one, dealer? I don't know. Derek Conway. What the hell? Sounds like a total new. Oh my god, he was even uglier the under the mask. Is, you defeated Jonathan Arkham, and I said Jonathan Arkham will never get a shot at that pure title. But you never, ever beat the Irish Submission Kid, Irish submission Derek King. Conway. Submission King. Oh, so what makes him, what makes him any different than Jonathan Arkham? He's still the same guy. It doesn't matter. If he's Jonathan Arkham or Derek Conway or okay, Afro Pegasus, man. it doesn't hey, matter. How's no. the surfing going for you, Afro? Yo, Pegasus! Excuse me. Yeah, I know. I love it. So the fact is, next week the anniversary show, what you are going to do is you're going to put that pretty little pelt on the line. You can kiss it, you can shine it up, you can use it for a coaster for your Goyer malt sodas, because that's what you like to drink with your malt beverages. And you can pass the championship off to Mr. Conway when he makes you hit the mat and tap out like a little bitch you are. Oh, like a little bitch that I am. I love this guy. He's hilarious. Oh, my God. I don't see any reason why I should defend this belt against you. You have never deserved a chance at my belt. All you have done is try to sneak attack me, chip my teeth. You have earned no respect, no respect whatsoever. Too soon, man. Too soon. Too, too soon. soon. Oh, my God. Too soon. Too. My bad. My bad. So... As far as me defending this title against you, I don't see the reason. You're not in my league. I beat you at Hellbound. I beat you at the Away Show in Newton. I you beat never you beat at me. Apocalypse. No, no, no. Let's get something straight right now. You never beat me. You beat Arkham. Uh. Arkham's gone. Out the window. Personal you beat disorder. him. You beat a person in a mask. As you can see, I think it's pretty clear. They got it pretty clear. There's no mask. 75% Reyes. 75% took you, psycho in the back, to the limit. Now, it's Derek Conway. Now it's a whole new game. No flaws, no weaknesses, no nothing. Okay. While you sit there like a lazy Mexican or Samoan or Puerto Rican or Cuban, oh they're all God. the same. 
No matter what you do, you won't come clear to me. Because last time I checked, Hellbound happened, and you were right here. Okay, let's just right shut here, up. tapping shut out, up. right? Shut he was tapping up. out. Shut up. Anyway, you can't beat me. We've proven that again. You need a weapon to beat me. <laughs> Speaking of weapons, a loose cannon, I think, has had enough of this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Woohoo! One of the purest of the pure champions, Psycho. Mr. Johnny Psycho! Damn, got a cycle back. Yeah. Uh, dealer, have a seat. I'm just gonna sit. Check one. I can't hear myself. You can hear me. Oh my God. Okay. Guys, I okay. back. Okay. I'm gonna go back to my boat. Everybody else downstairs are tired of you three just out here running your mouth, ruining these people's good night. I mean, they don't want to hear you guys spout off at the mouth and not know what you're talking about. You know, pretty much waste everybody's time by going on and on and on, thinking you or you or you. Any of you three sons of bitches can cut promos. Are you done? Because you're talking about wasting time. You're a referee. You're retired. Go Stop home, Jeff. talking when other people who are better than you on the stick are talking. Shut people up, are tired. No no, 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 no! You don't yell. Just get out. So, why I'm out here is quite simple. You see, next week is X3, and on anniversary shows, former champions have the right to fight the current champions. Seeing as how you aren't a champ, you are just a chump, <laughs> that leaves just me left. So what do you say, Andres Reyes? Next week, me You're and you retired. won retired. You on left. You took one. your ball and went home. So we get the straight, we get the clear picture here. Next week, in this very ring, at X3, the anniversary show. A showdown for the ages, match of the year, main event quality. We're talking about a counter that will be remembered forever. We're talking about something that will be for one night only, once in a lifetime. Reyes versus Psycho, the Boricua Brawler versus the Loose Cannon, the pure Torica champ versus the purest champ ever. And you want me to give you an answer to your challenge? Yeah. Yeah. No, you need to accept Mr. Conway's challenge. You have no right to speak. Shut your mouth. Get a job, you hippie. I accept your challenge. Diva challenge. Diva. Yes. You look like God slapped you in the face. I wonder after why you, you are lose, a mask, you stupid dude, son of a bitch. Mr. Psycho, after you lose, you're going to pick up your ball, you're going to complain to everyone downstairs, and you're going to go home again, because once again, you just couldn't cut it in this ring. Is that what's going to happen? Hit him, please. No, he's going to get sick. I'd slap you in the face, but it looks like God already did. <laughs> oh, yeah, another stroke joke. Get up, hit him anyway. Okay, now that this promo has gone on way longer than it should have, um, do you guys have anything else to say that's relevant or important or has anything to do with anything besides putting... Well, um... Yeah, Moody Star, I guess that's something to say. Bouncing her way to the ring. Oh. Nice to check up enough room time out here. Got enough time. Talk and shit, shoot the breeze. Jeff? Hi, Moody. Hey, hey, looking good, Jeff. You enjoying getting hit on the ass by that revolving door you seem to keep using? You gotta stick around? <laughs> trying to think of something funny to say, but Time's I don't know, it's kind of hard because you bang so many guys and they slap you in the face with their cats. <laughs> oh my god, that's true. Anyway, I would think that you guys would want to wrap whatever it is you're doing up right now and start getting ready for tonight's main event, which will feature 
your Tariqan champion, Andreas Reyes. For the millionth time returning, Mr. Johnny Psycho. Former champion, Troy Garbo. Taking on Derek Conway. Derek Conway, Twitty. How precious is this guy without his mask? He's so darn cute. No. Yeah, yeah. Conway with Michael James and the brand new WWE champion, no, no. Carnage. No. The aging That's demon. That's how it's done. There's event. You gave him two black mics? Well, I guess that's uh, <laughs> Moody Star laying down the law, setting up the show for the main event. Losers first, come on! Losers first! Losers first! Hey, we're going ladies first after you. You want to get out of this match too? Yo, dude looks like a lady. Come on, go! Yeah, buddy. Yeah, yeah buddy. Hey, can I get some more? Oh, All bitches. Squeeze him out of your asshole! Oh. Here you are! And shut up, epic fail! <laughs> oh, that was so original! Go drink some Goya, rob a bank! Alright, enough, enough, enough with that. All right.